So we have to explain what the purification is that Siddhartha came up with. This practice was called right effort before. But effort got lost in translation over time. And effort turned out to be a lot of unnecessary hard work and pushing and personal effort. But the truth is that the progress you make in your practice is by how you remove yourself and desire becomes less and less and less. Instead of trying to make something go away, step back and allowing it to pass away. Purification was important, and Siddhartha knew this in his practice. This is what he basically came up with. Right effort. Number one, recognize an, any unwholesome mind state. Number two, release the unwholesome mind state and relax your head, any excess tension that's in it. And that directive of relaxing comes from tranquilizing the mental formation in the instructions of the practice of Anapanasati or any meditation practice, this should always be applied. So we have recognized the unwholesome mind state. Number two, release the unwholesome mind state and relax. Number three is the second part. And that part is number three, bring up a wholesome mind state to replace that and number four keep that wholesome state going now when we're teaching we explain very clearly to you what is a wholesome mind state and what is an unwholesome mind state we explain to you very clearly that you can get this motion a purification and retraining of mind to happen in one flowing motion by practicing the tranquil wisdom insight meditation which is actually re recovered right effort with all of the steps involved sadhu 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 we next talk about more closely the retraining of the mind <laughs>